It's official. We have our first video leak out of the Fallout TV show that looks like a clip from the actual show. And I'm going to be covering this video as well as a bunch of other leaks, including one I'm particularly excited about at the end with heavy machinery and big guns. So let's get into this video first of all. This video is obviously in Vault 33, where we have seen dozens of leaks and promotional photos come from the Fallout show, official Twitter, Kilter Films, and the Amazon account. So Vault 33 is definitely in the show. And about a half dozen leaks. And then in this video, we see two gentlemen appearing to talk to each other. This conversation seems a little threatening, right? First of all, the guy on his right is holding a laser rifle and some ammo for it in one of his hands. And the guy to the left is wearing a nice little hat there, and has a Vault-Tec lunchbox, and is standing impeccably still. I've watched this video like dozens of times, and at first I thought the guy on the left wasn't moving at all, and I was like, either that's a very detailed mannequin, or this guy is amazing at standing still. But you gotta keep in mind, this video is only two seconds long, and now that I've watched it a billion times, he does appear to be moving. Now keep in mind, the quality of this video is not so good. It appears to be a video of a video screen, like a playback screen you'll find on any set in America, across the world, so they can get their framing right, shots right, lighting, all that kind of stuff. So, I think I'm ruling out someone that's frozen or a statue or something. This appears to be a heated conversation. Now, I think that this laser pistol pistol's almost tilting back his hat. Is there some kind of like Fallout 4-esque attachment to it on the end and he's pushing his hat back with it? Is the hat just in a peculiar position? Because it kind of seems that way. And I don't know. We know that someone leaves a vault in a very heated manner. How that goes down, we don't know. But the promotional photo had a person deceased on the ground in it. Let me know what you think in the comments. What could be going on here? If you're impressed that the guy on the left is standing so still, I am, honestly. It's crazy. Next up, we have this. New California Republic headquarters. Remember, the Fallout TV show has done some filming in Nevada, according to their IMDb. Are we going to get the NCR? I've heard people say that they have friends who work on the set and NCR is in the show. Grain of salt, but th this is interesting. It also appears to be behind some kind of barrier, have some pretty classic looking architecture, which in a later image we'll get a more zoomed out version of it. Or is it set dressers totally messing with us? I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments, because I honestly think it could go either way. Here's a bit more zoomed out. So you'll note in the last image, they were attempting to cover it in some way. And this image doesn't seem like they're attempting to cover it anymore. Again, you'll note that very classic architecture there. I mean, like classic for fall Fallout. You'll see like the metal on that is very of Fallout vibe in my mind. All right. Now, from this is from the same batch of those last two images. Someone in some kind of red armor with chest plate, shoulder plates. I was thinking knee and elbow plates and definitely shin plates and some kind of boots. And then behind him, you'll see what appears to be a set that they're trying to cover. I don't know if they're trying to cover more of the interior or the exterior here. Honestly, either way. This seems associated with that NCR sign because it came from the same building and same batch of images. Was that a mislead on the part of set dressers? I don't know. I don't think he is in um, Caesar's Legion because he. Uh, we all know Caesar's Legion loves a good field hockey skirt moment, and he's clearly wearing pants. So let me know what you think about this guy. Is it a scribe? Is it Brotherhood of Steel? I don't know. I want to hear your theories. All right. It's a wrap. The Fallout show wrapped last week, according to my source on set, and this leaked image, which appears to be from one of the stars, Ella Purnell. And uh, it's nice. She put a little cookie on there, said they're hardworking. I hope she gave them cookies, too. I'm imagining that that's what this was. So this was just a cute little thing. All right. A button. A vault door button. Along with a fridge that clearly says Hundo, the working title of the show, just kind of their code name. 
I think I can see the word dog under it, and beyond that, I can't read it. If you can read any of this better, take a screenshot, zoom in, let me know. And then some rubble. Classic. Gotta have rubble, right? So this is probably for a, a vault exterior. And then speak of the devil, a vault exterior. And the, you know, just a classic ring door, circular door. This appears to be, to me, because there is a staircase on it. It appears to be the outside of a vault, a la like Fallout 76, looking in. And there would be a door here. I'm imagining they had to like add that door in in post. Not a practical, uh, maybe not a practical effect. I definitely, it's definitely rem reminiscent of like Vault 76, especially with like the stairs and all that and just the shape of it. But I might be wrong. Let me know what you think. Also could be out inside looking out. Next up, a clacker from the set. Kind of not that interesting unless you read it, right? So from what I can read, now I think the numbers and letters here in the middle of it are like scene information. We're not going to get a lot out of that. But if you're in the film industry, let me know. I might be wrong. Atrium Ritual B. Are we having an, a ritual in a vault? I know that they were filming in vault sets in December, which this appears to be from December 5th from the date on it. And I'm excited about that. I want to see a ritual in a vault. <laughs> All right. This was a wrap gift. It appears to just be a nice winter coat. Remember, they filmed most of it in uh, New York. And hey, they did film some of it in Nevada too, apparently. And it also gets cold in Nevada. Deserts get cold, y'all, especially at night. Now, the image I am most excited for, the vertebird image. I think it looks pretty cool. Obviously, someone, whoever took this image or posted it, censored the face. Good job. I got these images from Hunter World V2 on Twitter, and he pulled them off of Reddit. And you can see, like, a light panel outside of it. it looks like we're going to get a lot of cool, like, practical effects with the vertebird. I'm thinking Brotherhood of Steel. We already have seen power armor from the show with indicators of brotherhood of steel on it we could see the flight equipment there's like a tactical box right there and of course the goat the minigun looking great looking accurate to uh fallout 4 i can't wait to see this bad boy spin and heat up and shoot out hot metal it's pretty exciting another thing to note in this image have you noticed it pretty puffy white clouds pretty blue sky around that and brown mountains Unless that's a backdrop, which I don't feel backdrops are used as much, but you never know. Maybe they're going practical effects. I just don't feel like green screen's that complicated. Is that the Nevada desert? Even if it is a backdrop, is that what they're going for? I mean, I'm from California and I go to Vegas for every single one of my tattoos and that looks a lot like what I drive through to get there. Um... I want to know what you think, though. I'm pretty excited. I'm thinking we're going to get some kind of something out west is going to happen. Now, there's no confirmation that they filmed in California, so I don't necessarily think it's California. That said, if they filmed in Nevada, y'all need to remember that the Mojave Desert is also in California, so they could easily fudge it if need be. A lot of California does look like parts of Nevada. Granted, there's a lot that looks different, too, but... You could easily film in one place and pretend it's the other. They do it all the time the other way around, California and Nevada. So let me know what you think about this in the comments. Do you have any theories about anything I posited here? Do you have any things that I you think I'm totally wrong at about? Let me know. I'll continue to cover Fallout leaks, news, everything as they come in, and of course, eventually trailers. It's supposed to air in 2023, and me and Nywall will be covering it on our podcast, The Capcast. So if you could do me a huge favor, f follow if, if you aren't already. And have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching.